Okay. We figured out the moose head. I have tethering now. And Stream Dex literally just said, fuck you. I am determined to play Resident Evil tonight. <laughs> I am determined to play. Anyway. I, am, I will do everything in my power to let you play. Okay, that first 30 minutes, 39 minutes, didn't count. You didn't see it. Okay. So we have the thing on the moose head. We have the weird little... The um, needle. Yes. Now, what do we do with said needle? Uh, return to the hallway we just came through to get here. Oh, is Billy not following me? That's a problem. Hold on. Hold on. Oh, how do you switch them from solo to a... Uh... Oh, that's probably a button. I don't know, I like how you I like how you lurk. Thank you. That's for you. Well if it's C I can just do this. Hold on. Let me just do T. Oh, it's Q. Okay. Okay, now they're a team. Okay. Alright. Uh go through the double doors to re enter the library. In the northwest, there is a candle next to a door. Use Billy's lighter to light it up. Where? Uh, I think it's that door with the three lit up bars behind Rebecca. Oh, there and it is. And to the left, yeah. That door unlocks. Okay. Blast away the zombies. And hop up onto the tall step up. It's the tall step up. Move the bookcase to reveal the book. Move the bookcase. Oh, uh, does it say left or right? It does not say left or right, it just says move the bookcase. Billy, Maybe you're in the, the fucking other... way. Oh, for fuck's sake. Either that or he's in the wrong way. Examine the book. Good. Yes. The book of good. Okay. Open it. Uh, go to go to your inventory. Examine it. Open it. There you go. You get angel wings. And, uh... Okay, hold on, though. On the Because Rebecca has the angel wings, so... Or has the white statue. Ah. Uh. Can't leave it here. Why? My inventory's full then. Anyway, okay. Sure. <laughs> uh... Back down... There you go. Okay. On the table outside the door you just unlocked, there's a microfilm. Of course there is. What table? Yeah, I don't, uh... 
kiivulainen. Oh, did we already? Yeah, we already got the microfilm. Okay, that's fine. Uh, return to the main hall. go back to that room with the gears so let me uh uh well i don't have inventory for anything else to pick up so oh yeah then we need a drop box do drop boxes exist in this game probably not yeah Maybe? What do you mean by room with the gears in it? It was... Where we killed the bug? The giant scorpion I... bug? That room? Possibly. You gotta, you gotta be more... <laughs> what would Jason say if he was here? <laughs> What's the point? What are you trying to make clear? <laughs> Okay, that's the sewer where we came in from, so... I'm trying to retrace the walkthrough steps, because it only said it- all it says is go back to the gear room. It doesn't say how, so I need to read further back to see how we got there in the first place. Was it up here? Was it this door? Where did I come out from? Was it this one? No. You stay here. Yeah. Follow me. Yeah. 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 Oh, what room? Okay, uh, to to the right. Go back into the classroom. There's a way through to the gear room through the classroom. Okay. So, not the fire door, but the other door. Beyond that should be the library. You mean the library that we were just in? This door. Where were we? Yes. Were we just in the library? Shit. This, this is where we used the lift to get up to the gear room, right. The f okay. There was a way, then there was a way back to the gear room through the main hall. We just have to find it again.
So yeah, on the first floor. What is if this the it? Lead? It can't be the first floor because we gotta go up. It has to be. You're, yes, that's the staircase. Yeah, those. Okay, I gotta do Billy. Those I gotta do Rebecca. Okay. Um, use the. Return to the gear room with Billy where you fought the centipede and keep heading back to where Rebecca was lifted a while back with the clock and the two plague crawlers. Use the iron needle to complete the clock. Okay, so you want the time to read 8.15. It's sad that people nowadays wouldn't be able to do this puzzle. Probably, yeah, okay. Uh, Probably not anyone born past 2010, certainly. <laughs> nope. Yeah, I was talking to a coworker who's around my age, and um, he's like, yeah, no, it's sad that people in our generation would be able to do this, and I'm like, oh my god. Don't do that to me. Okay. Um, it, now it says set the clock to hold. I don't know if that's what we just did. Were you watching the screen? Yes. So. Okay. <laughs> Make your way back to the main hall. Oh, Hana. Pat's head. Shakes feathers out. Hana is ruffled. Why are you so ruffled, little owl? Because I don't make any sense. No, this game makes no sense. <laughs> Just this little puffed up little bat. Don't worry, I understand. <laughs> Why do I have two puffballs? <laughs> I'm mad at myself. Han is mad at himself. It's fine. <laughs> so what should people do when you get mad at yourself? You puff up? Yes. Yes. He's a frustrated. This <laughs> moves down fur. Oh. Okay, um, enter the newly opened door on the east side of the upper walkway. Okay, so it's east has to be. It's gotta be this door. Ah, this game! You'll Ooh. be introduced to a small clan of zombies which need to be killed. So you want that glowy on the mantelpiece there, and probably the letter on the table. Cool. Okay. A verse of poetry. Oh boy. The moon bows to the earth, the earth swears loyalty to the sun, and the great law of the sun governs all things. This itself is the keystone, the pointer to glory. All our hands cannot open the door to heaven. To the heaven, excuse me. 
you got the A verse of poetry. Now it's time to get rid of these silly items from the main hall. Great, I love getting rid of silly items. <laughs> Go to the first floor. Can you give me a hall. moment? Okay. Oh. Okay. Uh, go to the first floor. Okay. And enter the hall to or the door to the west. Okay, that's fun. Yep. At the end of this hall is another of the clock opened doors. Beware though, as there may be a humanoid leech hatching in the hall as you pass. I guess there wasn't. This game's full of lies. <laughs> Ooh! <gasps> Take down the two zombies guarding the holy projector. The holy, the holy pro projector? projector. <laughs> it is holy. Alright, use the microfilm. I don't see a whole lot of holes. It's a microfilm projector. If you had some microfilm, you could project their contents onto the projector. Screen. No shit, Sherlock. <laughs> Thanks, game. You know, the comeback to that is fuck you, Watson, right? It's a picture of a room somewhere. Oh, insert the other one. I... Give me a moment, okay? I'm a bit flustered. Oh. This is an odd fucking seating chart. <laughs> uh, Bun is in seat 5. Bat is in seat 4. I want to be in seat uh. A, which should be next to 1, <laughs> but it's not. <laughs> Screams. Oh, it's in hexadecimal. Um, it's a picture of the layout of the classroom with labels at the desk. Once you've checked out the picture, the MO disc is ejected. Wow, thanks. Take it with you and return to the classroom. An image resulting from overlaying microfilms A and B. Numbers appear on the seats like, thank you. You're welcome. <laughs> Aren't we having fun? I'm having so much fun. This is a great yeah. time and a half. Totally. Cost gun. Totally. Breaks came over me. Totally. Uh oh. That one is a little more violent than I was. Where? Oh. Well, found the humanoid leech. I hate this game. Okay. Okay. Where now that we're back here? Okay, um classroom. back to the classroom. Yes. And uh once you're in there, examine the podium up front. And we still don't know what to do with these statue parts. Fantastic. Security system is locked. Please insert system disk. I like how it says umbrella system version 0.5. <laughs> like it's an act like they actually had other systems before this. Mm. That's rich. Sure, umbrella. Now, now loading. loading. <laughs> Yay! Progress. Complete. Complete. Please input code. Um. 
Okay, uh... 2D. There's no input device nearby. Sure there is. We just gotta... Nope. Uh, files. Uh. Okay, so it's like this one, and then it's this one. Did that do it? Did I solve it? Um, th there, there's a time limit on it, so you'll have to uh, leave one character at one switch and the other at the other switch. How, what is it for wanting to go alone? Q? Nope, that's map. Oh, well. I'll just do it this way. Progress. Good job. Can we leave now? <laughs> this way. Okay. First doors first. Right there in the classroom is the next point of interest. Go through the ornate doors that that were uh, released by the night swords. to enter a hall with two zombies. Stay back and let them come to you. Move down the hall until you reach the first set of doors. Giant chessboard. Okay. Word of caution, don't touch any of the chess pieces until you are sure what to do. Moving the wrong piece will in will trigger the introduction of poison gas into the room, and that's bad. All right. That does sound pretty Here's bad. You... Uh, take a look at the big board. See how the white king is in check? Um, move it... Move it south three spaces. You mean the actual giant? Okay, which... Um, the, the king is the white piece in the middle, yes. This one? Yep. Okay. So south three. One, two, three. Not a legal move in chess, but sure, we'll go with it. Move it to the right. Wait, hold on, or... I want to... not pushed all the way. Okay. Okay. Right one. Billy! Billy, <laughs> Billy get your fat ass all the way. Okay. Okay. And north two. Is 
So up. Mm -hmm. I literally could have just moved it down into the left. I mean, right. There was a rook blocking the way. That's why it had to be so complicated. Uh, once the puzzle is complete, you'll see a short animation. The desk has slid open to reveal a book. Retrieve the book. What's this? Ink ribbon, hell yeah. <laughs> the desk? Yeah. I don't That's what it says. This desk in the office or presumably. I, I saw like a chessboard slide. A, a mini chessboard. Yeah, that one. Oh, okay. It's just hard to see. Ah, evil. The book of evil. I can't you carry know what to it. Do with this. Oh, Billy. Burn it, obviously. <laughs> Can you move? Thank you. Billy. Billy! Okay. Marcus's Diary 1. December 4th. We finally did it! The new virus! Mm -hmm. We have called it the Progenitor. I want to carry it back and start detailed investigations immediately. March 23rd. Spencer says he's going to start a company. Well, I don't care, as long as I can continue my research into Progenitor. He can do what he likes. August 19th. Spencer keeps asking me to be the director of his new training facility. Maybe it's because of the business, but he's becoming intolerably pushy. But maybe I can turn this to my advantage. I need a special facility to properly explore all this virus's secrets. A place where no one will get in my way. November 30th. It's in the way, a place... but okay. A place where nobody will get in the way. November 30th. Damn that, Spencer. He came to complain to me again today. He thinks of Progenitor as nothing more than a money-spinning tool. Fool. School. Cool. Cruel. Mule. But if his influence continues to grow, it can only be bad for my research. If I am to properly develop Progenitor, I must strengthen my position, too. September 19th. At last. I've discovered a way to build a new virus type with Progenitor as a base. Mixing it with leech DNA was the breakthrough I needed. I call this new variant Virus T for Tyrant. October 23rd. It's no good. I can't hope for real progress experimenting on mere rodents. Only humans can be a proper mammalian subject for the experiment. Otherwise, I'll never make any real progress. November 15th. Oh my god, this guy knows how to fucking talk. Sounds like my coworker. Someone seems to suspect something about my experiments, but perhaps it's just my imagination. Maybe it is your coworker. <laughs> well, if anyone does get too close, they may find themselves unexpectedly assisting in my research. Oh, okay, we're playing like that. January 13th. Oh my god, he's still going? <laughs> At last, they are ready, my wonderful leeches. Those are low intelligence. They will never have the privilege of tasting the sense of joy and satisfaction. Now, finally, I can move against Spencer. Soon I will control everything. Hannah, I can't understand you when you read so fast. January 31st. Oh my god, it keeps going! <laughs> the devices I set to protect my work have been disturbed. It appears someone came looking for tea into the leeches. 
fool. No doubt the work of Spencer's group. February 11th. Ooh. Today, I again found evidence of tampering around the entrance to the labs. If this is what they are after, I must find a suitable way to deal with them. Perhaps I should have William and Albert smoke out the pests. Those are the only ones I trust, apart from my beloved leeches, of course. But Spencer, it wouldn't end there, would it? I will announce tea at the next director's meeting and collect my just rewards. Okay, so now we know how the tea virus is, was made. Took a whole entire novel's worth of exposition from Marcus. Thanks, but Marcus. we got there. Uh, okay, got the black wing. You're ready to set this into balance way. the scale yeah. of the female statue in the main hall. Who sent me a Discord message? Whomst. Whomst. On your way back. Huh? Make a pit stop at the infirmary, same hallway. Uh, where is it? Is this it? There. Oh, okay. What's in the infirmary? Herbs, first aid spray if you're poisoned, some notes on one of the beds. Ooh, we like notes. What? <laughs> and zombies. Forgot about those. <laughs> you forgot! <laughs> you... you just casually forgot. Owl fluffs up itself. You just... You don't think that's the first thing you should list to me? Herbs, first aid spray, if you need it. By the way, zombies. I forgot this was during a zombie game. Maybe. You know. But it's okay, because you have all that first, first aid spray. <laughs> Heaven forbid Han and I ever play a horror, horror game together, and Han is just like... <laughs> yeah, Mimi, don't come in here. There, there's first aid spray and bandages and bullets, and I get in there, and there's a bunch of fucking horde of zombies, and Hannah's just like, see, this is how they got me, too. They tricked me with the goodies. You didn't think to tell me there were zombies first? Uh, I forgot. <laughs> we're only playing a zombie game. <laughs> it's a doctor's examination, but the sheets are stained with blood. I, okay, but I want. Okay, but I, I, I see it. There we go. <laughs> yeah, I acknowledge it. First investigation unit notes. Okay. We are searching the facilities, and it looks like a lot of the chemicals survived. Fortunately, the storage tanks are still all full. We have just started, and there is a lot we still don't know, but it appears that the chemicals can be mixed to produce new substances. That's cool. The chemicals are scattered all about, not because of the accident, more as a result of plane mismanagement. When we reopen the facilities, we will have to develop a system for dealing with these chemicals. Something is scrawled on the back of the note. Red plus blue equals sulfuric acid, green plus red equals stripping agent. That's not how colors work, but okay. <laughs> so somewhere in this room, apart from dead zombies, is... A green canister? Yes, a green canister. Put it in the mixing set. Yeah? Yep. Okay, when you're done here, you can go back to the main hall. And zombies. <laughs> and zombies. And zombies. All right. Back of the main hall. You may combine the white wings with the white statue, and the black wings with the black statue. Oh. Okay, give 
give me a moment. On here? Yes. Something written on the base. When good and evil are brought into balance, a new path will be opened. So, what do you mean I don't? Eh? Do I use the book? I am confusion. That, that is what the walkthrough says. Is it because it wants the good, the white to be on the right dish, and you are in front of the left? I, um... Back to the video we go! <laughs> My god... Oh, you got it. Damn, this game is finicky. Okay, but it's not balanced. <laughs> is the black statue supposed to have another wing? Maybe it means the black statue is lighter and should go on the right while the white goes on the left. No, I want the... Give me the statue back. Won't let me pick up the statue? Okay. In I picked up the black one, but I can't I can't get the white one. In the video the okay, we did have it right. In the video the white is on the right and the black is on the left. It looks like there's just no cutscene that plays. You're just supposed to know. Okay. Let's regroup. Roger. So now what? Hold huh. On. Black, black wing, black.
Oh, okay. The walkthrough doesn't say this, but the video says there's a second... You're right, there's a second black wing that we don't have. So, I have to see... So my girlfriend's smarter than the walkthrough, got it. There's a Slade in chat, baby. Hey, Slade. Hi, Slade. I looked okay. in and he's like, hey. <laughs> How you all doing? That's my slate. Uh, trying to figure out these puzzles. But where would this other wing be? If you find the good statue, evil statue, use the book. I never played any old Resident Evils. I hate. I hate this type of camera. You're telling me. Yeah. Oh, this should be right. The what the fuck? We're very frustrated with this game. Yeah, this game makes no sense. I'm really hyped for tell. the RE4 remake. Me too. I can't wait. It looks really great. According to everything I'm seeing, there is only one black wing. The white one is missing the wing and the scale of the... Okay. Uh... <laughs> Uh, Slade never played any old Resident Evils. I just read that. I hate this. Yeah. I just read that. It's kind of. Nelly. Oh, nice. Okay, well, I can't remove the, the white one, so. Then the white one must be right. Really freaking awful. the fuck? Okay, in this video, the black statue does have two black wings. Where the fuck did he get a second black wing? I don't know, Hana. Did you, did you open the Book of Evil and take the black wing out? You didn't tell me to do that. Oh. You didn't say anything. You said, just get the book. And I was just like... My, we opened the book of good, and my brain conflated the two events. Puffs up itself. So much. I. It's my favorite Resident Evil game, didn't you know? Now 
now they're balanced. Whoa. Does this mean we can leave now? Yes. Yes. <laughs> This game is co-op? I don't think this one is. No, I don't think so. door at the end of the hall. This is the basement safe room. That's how I want to read. Typewriter. I will leave the stream open to help out, but I'm going to bed. Things are not good in my home, so I just want to get some sleep. Sorry, I can't be watching. You're fine, Slade. Make sure you take good care of yourself first. Your health comes first. Yes. Always. Okay. There's a... Once you're satisfied with the stuff in here... Oh. Matthew's ca a Correctional Institute inmates list. Matthews K, deceased, disposal complete. M M Midge D, deceased, disposal complete. Keith W, preserved as a specimen. Savage C, transported to research facilities. Royce M, transferred to research facilities. David's A, preserved as a specimen. Clark A, transferred to research. Ellen's J, transported to research. Terrence O, deceased. And okay, yes. well, <laughs> okay. Find the in this room, find the corner with a small hole where you can give Rebecca a boost. Of service. Time to go inside. The door is locked, so read the notes on the ground near the door to figure out how to open it. <gasps> oh, this is all sorts of. We of found the torture, torture. dungeon. <laughs> About the power regulator. Due to the recent lightning strike, the power regulator continues to be inoperative. It wouldn't really matter about the power except for the fact that the boiler room equipment is on the same grid. The equipment is so run down it'll probably have to be fixed up all the time. If you wish to exit rapidly, set the indicator to 70. Check first though that everything is connected to the chain. Okay. So we need to set the regulator to 70, so it's a walkthrough. And this is some kind of switch puzzle. Oh, I'm good at these. Okay, go for it, Mimi. Yeah, she, she loves them. Oh. 
Oh my, that was drastic. puzzle is unfair. It makes you go through all five switches exactly once with no chances to redo without doing the whole thing over. So it was, it was two and four. Ah, so down decreases it. Okay. So... So we want to get up to 100, so we need to add 70 and then subtract 30. So... Oh, so if we can figure out how much voltage each switch adds. Just tell me what it is, because we're going to spend way too much time on this. Okay, I'll look up the solution. It's easier if I can do it, you know, without yeah. going through. Everything but the third switch should be up. regular has been activated, two doors will open, one for Rebecca to get out, the other door in the hall with the giant spiders. As well, the steam coming from the boiler room equipment has ceased to bellow out. But not all is good, Rebecca is attacked by an eliminator ape and cornered, putting her on insta time. unstable ground. I have already claimed this place for myself, which means you are trespassing, and I am very territorial. <laughs> Monkey.
It Bye, just Rebecca. doesn't make sense. Bye. Do you honestly believe this to be the real identity of that crazy young man? Impossible. But if somehow it is true, then Umbrella will be finished. If the old conspiracy against Dr. Marcus is revealed, Mr. Spencer's career will be over. Not to mention ours, too. So, the time has come at last. What are you going to do? I will simply say goodbye to Umbrella. The biological weapon utilizing the T-Virus has almost been completed. Our only remaining task is to acquire combat data. You can't be serious. I refuse to abandon my work. I have finished the research on the T-Virus, but I need a little more time to complete the more powerful G-Virus. Do as you wish. I will follow my initial plan and lure the STARS members into the mansion. Their superior combat training should make them perfect test subjects. <laughs> Fuck you, Oscar. In the meantime, oh my God. something must be done about that madman. As I recall, URC is equipped with a self-destruct device in the basement. I'll find it, set it off, and annihilate the place to nothing more than a massive rubble. Uh, oh, uh, I can't hold on. Oh. Well, you better hold on for 30 to 60 minutes, Rebecca. Okay. Billy time. Billy is going back to the main hall. We're not gonna get Rebecca. The uh, the main hall is is on the way to Rebecca. Apparently, we need to go the, through the dining room to the boiling to the boiling room. Oh, that's where she ended up. Apparently. Bad monkey. Bad monkey. <laughs> But how? Doesn't look like we can do it from down here. Have to go back through the main hall. Why can't I just pull her up here? <laughs> You're also not giving me the instructions. I went back to the main hall. Oh, uh... No. Not Hold on, I got myself turned around. Because uh. I went back to the main hall, I did. Are you sure? Double check before I go all the way up there. On your way back to the main hall, yes, yes, yes. Return to the main hall, go into the dining room. So yes, the dining room is, can only mean the main hall up out of the basement. Now, we can 
continue north into the hall. Inside the boiler room are a collection of herbages and a set of stairs delving back to the basement. As you move down the stairs, the first room you enter in this section of the basement is crowded by three Eliminator Apes. What do I do? Um, do I keep going once, or? It says once you enter the door, you'll save Rebecca like a hero at the last second. It doesn't say which door. Oh, it's that's fine. helpful, game. Yeah. Walk through. It's the real stellar. Stellar work. Uh, uh, oh. Uh, uh, Rebecca! Uh, uh, Hang on. I'll pull you up. Thank you. Don't mention it. Just keeping my word. We promised to cooperate with each other. Remember? This is Rebecca. Over. Rebecca, this is Enrico. Have you managed to locate Cohen yet? Over. Rebecca, answer me. No, sir. I have not found him yet. I'll continue to search for him. Over. Rebecca. My first mission, and I've already disobeyed orders. So much for my great law enforcement career. What is sweetie? Probably won't live long enough to worry about it. Billy, I just need to know. I need to know the truth. Did you kill 23 people? I'm not going to judge you. I just want to know the truth. It was around this time last year. Flashback. Our unit was ordered to Africa to intervene in a civil war. Our mission was to raid a hideout of some guerrilla forces located deep inside the jungle. But the hideout was far away from our entry point. Died from the heat. Others were killed by the enemy. Oh. In the end, only four of us survived. Only, there was no guerrilla hideout. What do you mean? The idiots in charge had us operating based on wrong information. But we couldn't just go back home empty-handed, oh no. Our leader ordered us to attack an innocent village. Get rid of them! Kill them all! Please, sir! Cease fire immediately! Shut up! Ugh. Did you execute those innocent people? Forget about it. Doesn't matter anymore. That was then, this is now. Besides, you said you wouldn't judge me. I'm not judging you, but it does matter. Look, now my people think you killed those MPs in the van, but I don't think you did. It was those zombie dogs, right? When they attacked the van, you were able to escape. Isn't that right? You don't get it. I've only got two choices left. Either report to the Marines and serve out my sentence, or keep on running for as long as I can. That's all. Okay. 
I don't think he killed those people, obviously. Yeah, I doubt uh. he did. I do think he killed his, he was a uh, scapegoated though. Turn around, is there a door behind you? I'm looking at a door right in front of me. Okay, just anyway, making sure. We're gonna save. Oh, I forgot. Rebecca has. Well, we're gonna get Billy some ink ribbon. Billy should have ink ribbon. So Billy can Billy. save. <laughs> Billy should yes. have typewriter skills. <laughs> Here you go, Billy. Just what I always wanted. It's your own typewriter? Kay. I did it. 25 words a minute. Oh my god. <laughs> nice job, Billy. We're proud of you. How many words can Leon write per minute? Hey, when he's writing to Ada his love, probably 180. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> uh, once you're ready, move through the door to the north, just next to where you saved Rebecca. It's probably this door. Yeah. Ada, my love, it yep, is so good me. to see you. I cannot wait until I have my short arms again. <laughs> <laughs> Upcoming is another giant spider haven. Thanks for the warning now. Freeze, criminal. Freeze, criminal. Spiders are criminals. They are. Take a right until you reach the next corner while you take a left and into the control room. Oh, well, <coughs> I'm here now. Uh. What room is this? Let me see. Oh, well, there's gross buggies there. Gross buggies? Apparently, super effective. If this is the room I think it is, there are parts in here that. Oh, locker key. Uh. Control room is loaded with ammunition, broken guns. Uh. If you manage to grab the locker. Okay. Contains a locker. Key. Yes. Now that we finally are making progress. Yeah. <laughs> the control room is littered with ammunition and broken guns. Ammo we don't need. Um, if you manage to grab the locker key, use it to unlock the small locker in the room. Duralumen. Duralumen. Ah, I need a passcode. Three eight five. Or I can just have Hana. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and we're in. The lock is open. Oh, a gun! It's Perfect! Gone. Oh, parts for a gun. Combine those with the pistol to upgrade it. Yeah! Look, look yeah! <laughs> it's fancy now. Okay. Uh. Split up the team. I'll go check over there. Yeah. And send Billy downstairs to the testing chamber oh. to glab. There you go, Billy. You're on your own. To grab the glittering item you see through the window. Um. Um. <laughs> Maybe Rebecca has to open it at the control panel? Oh. The walkthrough, uh. Hi! I have common sense! <laughs> the walkthrough? You have more common sense than the walkthrough, I'll tell you that. Yes, oh, oh god, that's gonna be annoying. Oh my goodness. So Billy's right. Yeah! Yeah! Okay. 
Atlas Hunter. Yeah. She's so good at this. All the right. Oh. I think it's the left one you need to click. I don't know. Yes. Okay. That's the one. Oh god, it's doing the same thing again. Oh, uh, Rebecca needs to race to the gate again. Oh, okay. That was going crazy. Yeah. So, which one was it? Probably the, the the right? That do it? Uh, no. Okay. So, center's left? Center is remaining. Who the fuck did it like this? <laughs> I'm willing to Who? fight you, Anna. Uh, left? Th th that was it. Center was it. Center was not it, because it did not move. Oh. But I'll try again. No, I did Rebecca, this game. And look, uh, I was right. Sits in corner, time self out. Battle shooting. I'm sorry. Oh. Battle sequence, my ass. Sequence door. Hoorah, I did it! Yay! Yay! Good job, me. Okay, now what? Uh, take Rebecca back with you. Let's regroup. Okay. And backtrack to the room just before where you saved Rebecca, where the apes were. Examine the animal statues in the center of the room. By logical deduction, you'll need to light their little torches in the pecking order. Using Billy's lighter. I lied, it's not really obvious. The order is deer, wolf, Hold on, belly, hold on, hold on, <laughs> hold on. <laughs> Slow, Hana. Damn. Slow. Deer. Wolf. Okay, that one kind of makes sense. Okay. What the fuck do you mean? Not again. It's very, it's very peculiar on how you're. Yeah. Okay, that makes sense. Stallion. That, okay. The, you're starting to lose uh, me. A uh, horse. No, no, no. As in, like, the pecking order. Oh. Wolves oh, gotcha. eat deer. Ho stallions eat wolf. <laughs> eat okay. 
Okay, what eats a stallion? Um, a cougar. Ah, of course. <laughs> How could I be so stupid? I did a whole animal <laughs> unit in ASL4. I should know this. What would Jason say if he was here? <laughs> How could uh, I be next. so stupid? Uh, a serpent. Ah, serpent of course. Cougars. Yeah, did, <laughs> yeah. It's that easy, guys. <laughs> And at the very, very top of the food chain, ruling from Mount fucking Everest, <laughs> is the eagle. Cause, cause eagles eat Krugers, <laughs> yup. <laughs> yup. Mm-hmm. That's... With the woodland creature. <laughs> Gate opens, granting you access to two more doors. The first door on, on, in the hall contains two items you want. There is a set of empty bottles on the table, and the Unity tablet in the fire. Mm-hmm. Yup. <laughs> the eagle's really on top because Okay. Let's go. Cool. You want both of those items, it says. Why? I thought the bottles only made the model pops. Oh. All right, what's the Unity tablet for? To represent Unity of all those animals in the pecking order, obviously. Oh. Silly, Hana. I don't really deal with you people. What's this? So no. Looks like on the deck. No, I want. <laughs> You know what I want, game. Game. It does know what you want, which which is why it's not going to give it to you. Ah, it's encrypted. Sometimes I hate Resident Evil. Anyway. Oh. Okay. Management trainee's diary. Perfect. What is that director Marcus researching all the time? And what's with his weird interest in leeches? Now your business. Interest? Seems more like love at times. Don't worry Ugh. about it, dude. <laughs> Rumor has it there's something dangerous about those leeches. It, it is true that when Dennis just touched one, he got ill with a fever. Don't worry about Again it. Again today, there were those horrible moans beyond that door. Let sleeping dogs. No way I'll go near them. Even if the director ordered me, I don't want to end up like Dennis. Fuck you, Dennis. That poor bastard scratching and scratching makes me itch just watching him. Must maybe go if can, but whoa, Dennis gone, I go hungry. Help. Mom. Aww. Okay. Does Rebecca have any inventory space? I don't know. I just... Yeah. Okay. I just don't want to have to come back all the way down here in case we do need that tablet. I mean, it's on Billy. Billy has it. I lied, Billy does not have it. Okay, so we will. I think picked it up. Okay, well, we'll go back to the other room and I'll pick it up again. This game's stupid inventory. Yes. Really missed those drop boxes. Okay. All right. So we can backtrack out of here and go back to the upstairs main hall. Yes, for real, the upstairs main hall out of the basement.
Is this it? Nope, that's not it. Um, how do we get back up to the main hall? Uh, go out this door. I know it has to be somewhere in the same room as the, as the animal statues. It's not of either of the doors we just tried. So, turn right around that corner, and then right around the next corner. Go all the way down the left hall. Oh. Okay. With the water key in hand, make your way to the old. Go upstairs. Oh, oh, wait. in this room. A zombie! Ah, that was the dining room. Then this should be the main hall. Yes. Up, up the stairs, take a right. We want to get back into that gear room. again to the door to the door with the water motif this one go upstairs to the main hall through the eastern door of the hall the gear room east again to the room where you found the grenade launcher Oh, east again to the room where we found the grenade launcher. I don't know what room that is. Let me, uh, let me backtrack through the guide and see if I can figure it out. Unless this is the water motif. This is the only door we haven't been through. Where is it supposed to take you? Uh... <clears throat> to the observatory? And unlock it with the water key, toss the key, get ready for horror, split up the team, through the water. You'll, ent you'll enter a hall, but don't proceed very far. Take an immediate right to the door next to you. I have no idea wh where you're talking about. <laughs> then this can't be the room. Okay, then I have no idea where you're talking about still. Alright, so I have to. F I have no idea where the guide's talking about, so I'm going to have to find where we found the grenade launcher. Oh! You need to find a better walkthrough, I swear to god. Okay, where? Um, down the- back down the stairs. 
just to the left down those stairs is another little door. Okay. Okay. Um, for the time being... <sighs> what room, Hana? Take an, take an um, immediate right out of the water door. So the door nearest the water door. That makes no sense. There was a door right next to the water door. It wants you to go there. What door? Okay, I must be fucking stupid because there is no door right next to the water door. There we go. What? Oh. Yeah, that's that one. Well, you gotta... I didn't read ahead. You need to... No, this walkthrough is awful. Because it's not clear on what door. Grab okay. the item on the shelf of vice handle. Uh, I wish this walkthrough was more clear. Okay. And now, run back out the door. And you may proceed to the next door in that hallway. Which door? Tell me. Because I'm probably going to miss it like I did this one. I'll watch for it. This one? That one. Yes. This game got me so frustrated. I screech. I cry. In this quiet room rests a dusty piano. Move Billy toward the piano and play it. through the opened doorway. I'll check it out. Okay. Take the battery from the wall. Switch to Billy and play the piano again. Make sure they're still going solo. Make sure Billy has the vice handle. It's time for Billy to be a hero. It's 
So, is Billy supposed to have both, or...? Uh, Rebecca should have the battery, Billy should have the vice handle. Okay. Okay, switch to Billy. As Billy exit the piano room... Are they separate or together still? Uh, separate still. Okay. And immediately have him turn to his right and dash through the door. Yes. You'll enter a hall with two more doors, one on the north and one on the west. For now, enter the door to the north. There are two zombies in this room. Vice handle on the southeast corner of the room to release the Unity tablet. Grab the item and make your way out the door into the uninhabited hall. And don't move Billy just yet, switch back to Rebecca for now. And take Rebecca back to the water door. to Billy. Uh, hmm. Okay. Take Billy back to the to the water door and uh, reunite with Rebecca. I had to skip ahead because it wants Billy to do some really convoluted stuff to avoid the humanoid leech and get healing items, but we don't need to do either of those things. So Let's regroup. Can Roger. Uh, exit this room the way we came in. I believe take a left back into the main hall. You've gathered two tablets from around the training facility, and it's time to find the last one. For this exercise, we'll venture outside. From the main hall, go through the front door, which is to the south, to appear outside in front of the training facility. There are no baddies to blast here, just a silly puzzle. Make sure you have the battery with you and your golden. When you're out front, use the battery on the eastern corner of the courtyard to power up the lift. Activate the lift to bring down a large cargo box. Doesn't say how to activate the lift part yet. As Billy, hop over the box and push it towards the center of the courtyard.
How am I supposed to push it? Oh. He's just got to squeeze a little bit. Rebecca. <laughs> You're shitting me right now, Rebecca. Rebecca Chambers. Stay right there. Okay, there are a few pillars mostly crumbled. One of the pillars has a sparkling item on top of it. Maneuver the cargo box in front of the tall pillar with the sparkle. Mount the box and retrieve the last tablet, the discipline tablet. Where are these pillars? Uh, right there on the left side of the screen. I see the sparkle up top. Where? Oh, that pillar. Yeah. Hey, it let us get in one this time. Uh, I need I need to switch over to Rebecca. This belly really doesn't have any more storage. Okay. Alright. You're ready to leave the training facility behind. Uh, let's return to the gear room with all three tablets in hand. Finally, we can leave this for second place. Yes. Finally! Uh, lead your party members to the door. I'm already ahead of you. <laughs> okay. I'm already back at the gear room. All right, mm -hmm. from here you want to go through the night door, it says. You'll appear in the observatory. Where I was here before. Yes. Move along the walkway. To unlock the other door here, you'll have to make use of the tablets. Descend the ladder and move to some sort of... Um, it says move to some sort of dash. I don't know what, uh, oh, dashboard maybe? Yeah. Use the tablets in no particular order.
Okay. Freedom. 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 Before you move on to the next area, backtrack to the training facility and recover the hook shot. Where did we leave the hook shot? Uh... Why didn't it tell us to get that before we did it? Probably because it assumed we'd have no inventory space for it because of the tablets. Time to fight the walkthrough. I don't even know how to get back. Yeah, the the whole the whole or, the whole observatory just changed, or the whole training facility. It's down where the train is. That's right. Okay, so we're in the classroom. There's a door there now that leads. To just be thing. quiet for right now. I know where it is. Just be quiet. Just take a moment. Read ahead. Reflect. Gently muffles owl. Floof yourself. Unfloof yourself. Refloof yourself again. Make a sandwich. <laughs> Do something. You're just having him reset. Just hard reset. Yep, pretty much. Just <laughs> just reset. Go make go make a sandwich. My poor bun. This is the most stupidest thing ever. Throughout this whole walkthrough, it didn't say, make sure to go retrieve the hooks up before you leave. No. No, that would be, that would be too easy. You know what? I'm just... We're leaving the shotgun. It just takes up too much inventory. Actually, I wonder if we could just leave this. Can I, can I please pick this back up? There we go. Okay. This frickin' hook shot. Anna? Yes, Mimi. You good? Yes, Mimi. You sure? I'll try my best. Did you make a sandwich? Yes, Mimi. Look, we should stop saying yes, Mimi, okay? It's... <laughs> yes, I made a sandwich. What kind of sandwich? A tuna salad sandwich. May I have a piece? Cut sandwich in half, gives half to bun. Now that I got the fucking hook shot. <laughs> this game really likes to fuck with ya. Okay. God. 
I want to punch Wesker in the face because it would make me feel better right now. It's not time for RE5 though. Punch him in the face anyway. Oh. <laughs> Run down the path until you reach the front of the church. I mean, that's one way to guarantee the big bad never becomes a big bad. Knock his ass out before he gets powerful. Split up the team and have Rebecca go east into the small room. I'll go alone. Okay. Step on the square in the floor that activates the switch. Which one? It doesn't say. Try the mall until she clicks something. Oh. There we go. Keep her there and have Billy open the church doors. Those this are her ostentatious game. handles. This game. The game. Okay. Uh, there should be a typewriter in here. Once Sorry, you're ready. Rebecca comes in. Uh, not yet. Where is this tape typewriter? Where where is it? Um, inside the church, move up to the altar. Oh, up to the altar and go right into a safe room. So it's beyond that door. My bad, I thought the altar was the safe room. Once you exit the safe room, you'll be confronted by a giant bat. Not a little blue blue not a little blue booby fruit bat, a giant bat. Oh dear, that's my cousin. Shoot him. <laughs> He's a dick. supposed to happen? It's just an attack. He's being carried off. <laughs> oh my god. That's what I do when the fruit I find. Kick them way off and you use them. By the dramatic entrance of the bat, a gaping hole has been ripped open in the church of the roof. Grab the hookshot and grapple your way up to the roof. Okay, but where though? Once again. Oh, there we go. Oh. <laughs> Angles. Move to the back of the roof and climb down the ladder. There's a switch on the wall next to the base of the ladder, which powers the elevator on the western side of the laboratory. Proceed west to unlock the fence gate.
west? Uh. Oh, this gate, okay. It's more east, but okay. Game just can't use up, down, left, or right, can it? Oh, be too easy. Be far too easy, Hana. You're right. I guess we're just leaving Rebecca. Uh, have. Oh, this. I didn't know this is the elevator. Regroup the characters and enter the elevator to burrow deep into the laboratory. <sighs> Rebecca! Just gonna head right back up real quick. <laughs> there is no West, though! <laughs> Why? Why is it directions in this game with these camera angles? <laughs> West could be literally anything. What is the north in this game? There's no compass. <laughs> <laughs> what is West? Why well, couldn't say on the left side? See, there is no... Oh. Follow me. Yeah. That's stupid. That's very stupid. That is 100%. Hana, write this walkthrough, but write it better. And post it <laughs> online. So that fix people it. don't ha fix it. So people don't have to suffer like me. Watch the walkthroughs if you have to. Just compile a better walkthrough than anything you've been finding. Be that person, Hana. Be, be our hero. Uh, you'll enter a cramped library. You can save your game here with an ink ribbon, then check out the surroundings. There are some papers on one of the tables, and a hole in the ceiling. I think maybe we should... we should... we should stop. <laughs> that doesn't sound like a bad idea. Yeah. I... I, th I think we should stop. We've been going at this for two hours. I feel like we've done a lot. Not counting the yeah. 30 minutes with the moose head. <laughs> oh, goodness. Okay. I'm done. I'm... I'm done. I'm... I'm done. I'm good. I'm satisfied with my Resident Evil tonight. All that fun stuff. Anyway, thank you everyone so much for coming out and hanging out with me for part two of the Resident Evil series. I love this game so much. So much. You adore it. <sighs> totally. Yep, absolutely. With that being said, I hope you guys have a good rest of your morning, afternoon, or evening. Whenever you are watching this, I'm going to pick out someone to raid. Make sure you guys take care of yourselves. Tomorrow is Friday, which means the start of the weekend. Woo! You got this. One more day left of the week before you can hopefully relax and chill. Without further ado, as always, stay lit, my pyros. I'm going to catch you in the next one. Bye! Bye!